Hey folks, this is my latest contraption. Uh, what you're looking at right now is a 6502 processor. It's a uh, brand new 6502, a CMOS version, 65CO2, but uh, pretty much the same as the original. I have it on a breadboard with um, an Atbell ATmega32, which is going to be supplying it with data on the data lines here and also is in control of the reset, the bus enable, and clock lines. So it's going to be feeding it a clock and um, it's able to also give it some data. Right now it's actually just supplying it with a NOP command uh, which is uh, hex EA. Uh, over here, this isn't hooked up yet, you see some uh, SRAM, 128 kilobytes and uh, this right there is a button that will eventually manually step the processor through each instruction. Right now it's not hooked up. This one is a reset button to reset the AVR and when you do that, oh and this whole mess of wires over here is uh, a hex out that I made. It's reading the addresses on the address bus. Uh, I've got it clocked very very slowly right now and it's just manually stepping through uh, instructions. They're all knobs, so it's going to one uh, memory location after the next, uh, doing basically nothing in an endless loop. I will uh, reset it here, and you can see it go to memory location, I believe it's uh, FFC and then FFD, and um, look for instructions to get started. Here we go. Okay, reset. All right. So there's the first, should be coming up, there it is, FFC and FFD. And that's where the 6502 goes when you reset it to get its first instructions. And of course, uh, because the data bus is just full of no operation, that's all it's doing continually. But this proves that uh, the processor is working and I have the rudimentary beginnings of my 6502 computer. Thanks for watching.